Okay, step three to power launching your network marketing business is the invite. Now, I believe personally that this is one of the most important skills that you need for the success of your network marketing business. And why do I believe that? It's because there's tools that can help you do everything else. There's tools that can help you present. There's tools that can help you close. There's tools for everything. But you have to invite your prospects to take a look. You have to become, now again, I'm talking to you all like you're part of my team. So I always challenge my team to become professional inviters. Just really lock in and focus on your invite and really keep it simple. The thing about network marketing is that when people get started, they come, they become like a network marketing robot and they forget all of the people skills that they had prior to being involved before they were getting paid to talk to people, right? So I always tell my team, listen, just be normal. Just be yourself. Talk to your friends, your family members, the people that know you, love you, and trust you, just like you would talk to them any other day, right? You invite people to take a look at your opportunity the same way that you invite them to dinner, the same way that you invite them to take a look at a movie on a Friday night. So I'm going to go through a couple invites that I like to use that's personally helped me make a lot of money inside of the industry. And I've been able to teach other people and they've had some success with it as well. So the first thing that we want to do is understand what are we inviting them to? We are inviting them to our Zoom presentation, right? Because we know that we're creating a, we're creating our, that our meeting is going to be over Zoom, right? We know that. That's what we're inviting them to. So the first step that you have to do is clear the time, clear the date. So we're going to act like your, present, your, your, your first launch event is tomorrow night at 8 o'clock p.m. So what you want to say is, you know, you want to call up the top person on your list. Let's say it's John. It's your brother, John, right? You call John up. Now you can call or text, and I'm going to get right there. So calling versus texting. Um, I've heard this from a million-dollar earner inside of the industry. If you, you want to always present your business with a sense of urgency. So in these days, especially in 2020, what says a sense of urgency more, a call or a text? Right now, if you call, it must be important because people rarely call. So that's the type of energy that you want to have with your business. So I've, I've done both. I've seen people win doing both, but I'm a little bit more on the call side because I know that it, it sends a message of importance and it sends a message of a sense of urgency. So. You call up John, ring, ring, ring. Hey, John, what's up? Hey, Steve, how you doing? Man, listen, what are you doing tomorrow night at 7 o'clock p.m.? John says, I'm free. Amazing. Listen, I have a new project that I'm excited about, and I want to get your feedback on it. Can you be on a Zoom presentation tomorrow night at 8 o'clock p.m.? Yes. Great. I'll send you the link to the to the presentation to the meeting at around uh, 745, just as a, as a reminder. Um, but let me know if you cannot, you know, make the call. Let me know, please. Let me know because spots are limited and I want to make sure that someone else gets it if you can't get on. This is huge. I'm excited about it. All right. Talk to you soon. Bye. That's how you invite. I'll go through it one more time. Um, let's say you're calling your sister, Debbie. Ring, ring, ring. Hey, Debbie. Hey, Steve, what's up? Listen, what are you doing tomorrow at 8 o'clock p.m.? Oh, I'm free. Amazing. Listen, I have a brand new project. I'm excited about it, and I wanted to get your feedback on it. It's huge. Can you be on a Zoom presentation or a Zoom meeting tomorrow night at 8 o'clock p.m.? Yes? Awesome. Good. Great. I'm going to send you the link at around 745 for you to be able to jump onto the Zoom link. And it's, it's going to serve as a reminder. Okay. Great. Great, great, great. Thanks. Bye. See, the, the, the thing is you want to keep it simple. Um, you don't want to say too much over the phone because understand your opportunity, um, your opportunity, your presentation, the tool that you're using is sort of like a movie. And you want to give your, you know, you want to give your guests the best view. And if you start explaining it over the phone, you're not giving them the best view of the opportunity, especially if you just got started. 
So just like if you went to a movie, if we both, you know, if you go to see a movie and you come home and tell me all about it, am I going to get the same, you know, effect that you got by going to see it? Absolutely not. So don't rob your guests. Don't rob your, you know, your friends, your family, your network of seeing the information the correct way. Because again, all we want to do is educate and collect a decision. So you want to clear the date. That's so important to clear the date. The next thing that you want to do is also just extend an invite. Hey, I have a new project I'm working on. I have a new idea that I'm launching. I like to say that too. I have a new idea that I'm launching and I'm really excited about it. Um, and I just wanted to get your feedback. I just wanted to share with you, right? It's important to me. Can you be on a Zoom meeting tomorrow night at 8 o'clock p.m.? Awesome. I'll send you the link. Now, if they don't, if they do not, if they're not available, that's when you stop. So if I call John and John said, hey, I'm busy tomorrow at 8. Okay, don't worry about it, John. I'll get back with you in another time. Again, we have other launch events that we have on our schedule. So you don't want to, you don't want to press the issue. You don't want to play ball when John is not available. You want to always keep that posture. Keep your posture inside of the business and you know you will come out on top. Thanks.